This is Evolve's GTR Series 2 Bamboo Electric Skateboard. It's the latest electric skateboard from Evolve that can switch from off-road tires to longboard wheels that are perfect for carving city streets. Evolve sent us their new GTR Series 2 in the bamboo version so we could put it to the test and see how it stacks up as potentially one of the best electric skateboards you can buy right now. We also got the street conversion kit so we could test it with both off-road wheels and the longboard wheels. Unboxing the board, it comes protected in a large box. Inside, you get the board along with a nice hard shell case full of accessories. Inside that case is a multi tool, the charger, and the remote, which also comes in its own small separate case, along with a USB-C charging cable. You also get the manual along with a few decal stickers. Looking at the specs of this board, it has dual 3000 watt motors, which are belt driven from two brushless motors in the rear. The board comes stock with a set of seven inch wheels with pneumatic tires, which are all terrain. And that means the tread is good both for the street and off-roading. Now looking at the deck, it's made of three ply bamboo along with two ply fiberglass mix. This gives it the ability to have nice flex, which is perfect for street riding and carving. The top of the deck is also concave on both the toe and the heel for better grip and control when riding. And we really like this. It gives it the ability for deep carves and makes your feet locked right into the board. Meanwhile, the battery is on the bottom of the board in a flexible enclosure, which houses a 504 watt, 14 amp hour battery, which is packed with 18650 lithium ion cells. For weight, the board itself weighs 25 pounds with the street wheels or 26 pounds with the all-terrain wheels and has a max rider weight of 220 pounds. Now that does make it heavy to carry for long periods of time. And since you can't take the battery off to charge, you'll need to lug your board to an outlet in order to charge. The trucks are what Evolve calls super carved trucks. Now these are a double kingpin design, so they are able to carve really nicely while still being able to stay stable at high speeds. They also allow you to have much tighter turning radius than regular trucks. You can also change the stiffness of the trucks easily using the multi-tool, and you can even buy different bushings to fine tune the ride even more. Looking at the remote, it's the latest version from Evolve called the Phase Remote. It's made of aluminum and feels nice and sturdy in the hand. It features a dual trigger design along with a dead man switch. The front trigger is the throttle while the top one is for braking, and the triggers are a nice size, big enough that you can easily use them even while wearing gloves. The display on the remote is a full color LCD display and there's three buttons on the front of the remote for powering on, selecting, going up and down to change riding modes, and navigating the menu. In the settings, you can change a bunch of different settings like units from kilometers to miles per hour, turn the dead man switch on or off, or change the speed limit of the board. And the board has four different riding modes you can toggle. Eco, Sport, GTR, and Custom. You can also track your rides, showing your most recent ride or all-time ride totals. And in the My Board section, you can change the wheel setup, see the board temperatures of the components, or check details on the battery. There's also a way to control the lights, but more on that later. So getting into the riding, this is our first off-road electric skateboard after having ridden boosted boards for many years and thousands of miles. For off-roading, we immediately fell in love with the Evolve. We found some great trails that were pretty flat with pine needles and not many tree stumps, and this quickly became a great place to progress in the trails. And as you progress, you can start getting into slides, which can be done fairly easily by quickly braking to let the rear wheel slide out. We also took it in a big grassy field to see how it handled in the grass. While it definitely slows you down and uses a lot more battery, it was still super fun to carve and even slide around. And since the tires are all terrain, they also are very capable on the road. They're actually super fun to carve and the air filled tires gives extra cushion for rough parts off the road. Now for the street wheels, you'll need to buy them as a separate set which Evolve sells on their website for 250 bucks. And it comes with everything you need to do the swap. The swap is easy and can be done in less than 10 minutes using the multi-tool and Evolve has a great video showing the process. The 97 millimeter street wheels that come in the kit are super fun for street carving and also give you a higher top speed of 27 miles an hour, while the off-road wheels give you a slower top speed of 24 miles an hour. The wheel size also makes a difference with torque, and the street wheels you'll have noticeably more torque and acceleration than the larger off-road wheels. For range, Evolve advertises 31 miles for the street wheels and 19 miles for the all-terrain. In our test, we found that the range depended heavily on how fast we were riding and the type of terrain that we were riding in. So if you ride in GTR mode and you're doing heavy acceleration, you can can expect the range will be much lower than advertised. Looking at additional accessories you can add to your board, lights are definitely at the top of the list. Evolve sells the Prism Strip LED lights for only 25 bucks on their website. These are super easy to install and they hook up to two dedicated ports on the back of the board. Once installed, you can easily turn them on and off from the hand controller and change a bunch of different colors and patterns. It can even blink red when you're braking, which is a great safety feature. And to light up the path even more, Shred Lights sent us a pair of their front and rear lights that can be mounted on the top of the board. Their SL1000 is their newest skateboard light that's super bright and will light up the road up to 80 feet ahead. 
you can quickly change the brightness and modes from a press of a button. And they also sent us their SLR1 light for the tail light. So we'll put links in the description of this video if you want to get yourself a pair for your board. Looking at a few other features of the Evolve, another added bonus is the mobile app. The mobile app allows you to track rides, customize more of the board settings like fine tune the power, acceleration, and braking curves to exactly how you like it. You can even set three of your favorite customs to easily switch between. And you can also quickly change the light settings of the Prism LED lights if you have those installed. For charging, you're looking at a charge time between four to five hours from empty to full. And the remote has a USB-C charger and will quickly charge in about 15 to 20 minutes. And finally for the price, the Evolve GTR Series 2 is on sale from Evolve's website for 1,550 bucks. And they back their product with a 14 day money back guarantee and a 12 month warranty on the components of the board. So in conclusion, looking at a couple pros and cons of this board. The pros include great power, flex, and speed, ability to swap from off-road to street wheels, excellent remote with customizations, mobile app, awesome upgrades with lights. And some of the cons include no removable battery, long charging times, and heavy to carry. So overall, we think this board is one of the best electric skateboards that you can buy right now. Let us know in the comments below what you think of the Evolve boards and which board you think we should review next. Oh, and be sure to watch our other reviews of electric skateboards, scooters, e-bikes, and more right here on our channel.